Lesson number four. Listen and repeat. Chapter one of Tell It All, the story of a life's experience in Mormonism by Fanny Stenhouse. My early life. Now repeat. The story which I propose to tell in these pages is a plain, unexaggerated record of facts which have come immediately under my own notice, or which I have myself personally experienced. Please repeat. Much that to the reader may seem altogether incredible would to a Mormon mind appear simply a matter of ordinary everyday occurrence with which everyone in Utah is supposed to be perfectly familiar. Go ahead, repeat. The reader must please remember that I am not telling as so many writers have told in newspaper correspondence and sensational stories the hasty and incorrect statements and opinions gleaned during a short visit to Salt Lake City. Now it's your turn to repeat. But my own experience, the story of a faith, strange, wild, and terrible it may be, but which was once so intimately enwoven with all my associations that it became a part of my very existence itself. Please repeat. and facts, the two true reality of which there are living witnesses by hundreds, and even thousands, who could attest if only they would. Please repeat. This is the end of this lesson. See you in the next one.